Hi everyone, welcome to episode 4 of opening traps that every beginner should know. In this video we're going to cover a trap called the Siberian trap which pops up in the Morris Smith gambit. So here white plays pawn to e4 and black responds with pawn to c5, the Sicilian defence. White now plays the aggressive pawn to d4 and after black captures they play this gambit line pawn to c3. So if black accepts the gambit here White now brings out the knight, developing a piece. Black now develops with knight to c6. We have knight to f3, e6, bishop c4, queen c7. White now castles the king to safety, knight f6. And now queen e2, and black now plays the aggressive knight to g4. And this is where black is now setting a trap for white, because if white plays pawn to h3 here, the trap is now sprung with knight to d4. A double attack on both the queen and the knight on f3 which is defending this checkmating square on h2. So if knight takes on d4 we then have queen h2 checkmate. If the queen moves out of the line of attack then we chop the knight here and after queen takes we have the same checkmate. And we can't recapture the black knight on g4 here with pawn takes because then of course we just lose the queen. So how should white play in this position? Well probably the simplest is just playing pawn to g3 and then you block out all of this nonsense from the queen and you carry on trying to play in the centre of the board. There is also this knight b5 idea but after queen b8, h3, h5 it does start getting quite complicated and the themes going on here are actually quite similar to the fishing pole trap which crops up in a variation of the Roy Lopez. So if you do play the Sicilian defence, then I hope you found this video really helpful. As always, do subscribe to the channel if these videos are helping you out, and leave a comment down below if there's anything you'd like to see covered next. And I hope to see you again on the next video in this series. Thanks very much for watching.